Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can blur out a part of your video if, like, per se, is a license plate in it or you just don't want them to see your face. So what you're going to want to do is select the part of the video and uh, create a new timeline with that. I've already done that, so I just select that and I go to new timeline using the selected clip. But I've already done that, so I have this clip right here, and as you can see, there's timeline 1, timeline 2, and timeline 3. Timeline 3, I'm not using that one, but... So, basically, you have your video that you want to blur out or black out. It doesn't matter which one you choose to do it with. What you have to do is go down to the color section down here, and then have your selected clip. So, go over here, right-click, do Add Node, and select Corrector. Then just drag this onto the line. So drag that onto the line. Then you have two different ones. And for this one, you can uh, blur it out or anything. But first, what you have to do is get the select the circle shape. And make sure you get your face. So you pretty much, this is the softness of it right now. And I'd say uh, leave it a little like that. I'll select this to my face. Uh, let me see. I think that's pretty good. Let me see. So I'm moving it around. And uh, I'll move it that way a little bit. So you, you want it to track your face, basically. So what you'll do, you'll go over to the next section called Tracker. Once you have... Once you have this set, you, you can change the size and everything, and uh, the tilt and rotate. So go to the tracker section, and just uh, hit play. And you'll see there's little white dots. Uh, that's supposed to be there. Oh, you see, actually, it's not it's not getting my whole face, but it's getting most of it. So I can, uh, I can pause the tracking and move this, since I don't like this. I'll hit play again, and there it's getting my whole face basically. It's gonna it's gonna blur out that part, but you can actually do uh, a lot of things with this. You can make it the whole thing black, or you can just blur it out, and uh, it's almost done. So here up here you'll see you have two clips. You have the original one, and you have the one where it's uh, blurring out the face. So once you're done with that, you're going to go over to the section called blur and. It doesn't matter what you have it on, it doesn't matter if it's on blur, sharpen, or mist, they all do the same. So you see where the radius is. You just keep adjusting that to the point of blurness that it is. So see there I can all the way down and it's not blurred all blurry at all, and I can set it all the way up so that it is blurry. And I'll go back to the beginning and I'll play it. Okay, that's just me practicing my lines. So please do so. I play all sorts of video games and I show you how to do So there you go. Basically, that's how you blur out a face in DaVinci Resolve 14. Super easy. Now, if you wanted to have the face, like, black out the face, then what you would do is you would not go to blur. You would go to... You go to the first one called Curves. And then you go to the third option, so this is the first option, you go to the third option. Hue versus saturation. And you can uh, lower that to whatever color you would want it to be. So like, pretty much that. It's cool for some people, if you, if you want to black out a whole face, I mean, go ahead. But there you guys have it, that's how you uh, really, really easily do that. Bye!